CEO of Leeds Edutainment, independent promoter. Currently 38 years young, residing in Boston, Massachusetts. So Leeds Edutainment started in 2004 when uh, I was finished working at Metro Concepts. They kind of guided me on how to promote shows and taught me a little marketing and I started it. For my first show here at the Middle East, um, Voice of Five Minds, Juice, Color Linguist. So before that, I used to come to shows here back when I came. The first show here was in 1999 with CJ and the Damager. And I remember it was all, you know, everyone was smoking in here, smoking blunts, and cigarettes, and it was just a mess. But it was packed. And back then, we could pack it all out. And uh, it was probably like six or 700 people in here. It was just a crazy, intimate experience. And then from there, I saw Dilated People's Guru, Four Edges Teaching, and all these other you know, artists that I you know, loved growing up as a kid. Public Enemy played here. And it was, uh, this place was just legendary. So when I had a chance to put my first show here, it was like, I was like, wow, I'm part of this tradition of great hip hop. Like, it's all these great local hip hop shows that happen here. You know, so I'm going to them. So once I put my first show, it was like, wow. Luckily, I was able to figure out the system. You know, the system's paid off. So I'm a full time promoter. I've been doing this for 15 years. Also, you gotta understand when Leeds came on the scene, there weren't a lot of hip hop shows being done, and the scene wasn't popping the way it is now. And that's grown hip hop shit because of him. You know what I'm saying? Because he, he's brought a steady flow of underground hip hop shows through Boston. Boston. You know, everybody knows, everybody in the game knows Boston is one of the biggest markets, for, especially for indie hip hop. You know what I'm saying? The, the fan support here and a uh, big part of that is, is, is leads in this venue. So, uh, Eastern Standard Project, you know, started for me trying to do something that wasn't just a Boston thing, it was more encompassing, you know, East Coast sound. Uh, what's up? My name's Archetype. Producer based out of Cambridge, Mass, and doing music really kind of my whole life in one capacity or another, but uh, professionally as a music producer for about uh, 15 years. I first met Archetype, like I said, back in, you know, I don't even know how long it was. I just had heard about him as a producer and had his own studio. I wasn't really working with him. And then I, you know, I chose to work with him because I respected his, his hustle. I mean, he was a fellow entrepreneur like myself and was working equally as hard as me, if not more, running his own studio. So I, I kind of gravitate towards people that work hard in this business. And, you know, his production was, was perfect. You know, we both come from East Coast boom bap backgrounds, you know, as well as like listening to other music too. And that was very important to me, you know. Especially nowadays with the whole samples and everything, he doesn't use any samples for the most part. He's able to craft the whole sound of the record that I was looking for. And, you know, I, I'd come to him with a certain artist that I was like, oh, I really like this, this artist from this area, whether it be from Maine or Michigan or even West Virginia. And, you know, he'd craft something. He'd, you know, he'd listen to them and craft something new. And it's really about kind of showcasing what the entire Eastern Seaboard has to offer, you know, and uh, it was just a great process, you know, and, and the more we made, you know, the more I kept making and the more states I, the, I realized how long the damn compilation was going to be, it was going to end up being, ended up being 21 tracks and there's different people from different states and their perspectives and then have Architect Craft, craft the Sound and, uh, yeah, it just all came together, but it was worth it, you know, and um, I hope uh, everyone's uh, you know, happy with the project.